everybody, it's Free Comic Book Day, and we are celebrating by meeting up with our friend Bridget, and we're going to Golden Apple Comics. They're doing like eight comics for free, which A is lot. crazy. <laughs> Because uh, most of them are like two to five, but they're mm -hmm. doing eight. So we're going to be heading over there. Uh, there's some other comic book shops also in that area. So we're going to check it out and just see what we can find. Yeah. So let's go. And so our comic book adventure began. Bridget came and picked us up. And I was super excited about this because we hadn't been to a free comic book day in so long. It was really cute because they were doing like a treasure hunt. So it wasn't like, you know, you just went into the store and got all the comics in one place. It was a little bit of an actual adventure. And we got to walk around to a couple of the stores that were participating and pick up comics there. And it was just a lot of fun. It was honestly the perfect day for this because I was worried it was going to be really hot that day. But it, the weather was so so nice. It was like windy and cool. We just had a really good time picking up all the comics. We got so many. Honestly, most free comic book days, they're really stingy about how many comics they give you. You get like two or three maybe at the most, but they were giving away so many and it felt like at every turn. They were like, free comic book, free comic book. And we were like, no, we already got some, but they were like, no, no, here's more. <laughs> And Bridget ended up finding some that she liked, but she also picked up a few for us. So we got even more. I mean, I feel like we just walked away with so many. It was crazy. And then the coffee shop next door was a part of it. And they had a cool drink called like the Joker drink and it was purple. I didn't even ask what was in it. I was just like, hey, I want the Joker drink. Cause I mean, why, why wouldn't you want to try that? And it was so good. It was kind of like gingerbready, which I wasn't expecting. It was super yummy, but yeah. And then we just, you know, looked around to see if we could find anything new. They had dollar comics, so we got even more. And then afterwards, we decided to go over to Pink's Hot Dogs because I was not aware that this comic book shop was right next to Pink's. And this is one of my favorite places to get hot dogs. It is just so, so yummy. I freaking love them so much. And so of course I had to get a chili dog and some onion rings. Bridget got like a whole pile of onion rings and French fries. Uh, of course she shared some of the French fries with us too. And yeah, it was just like the perfect ending to our adventure out in LA for the day. We just, honestly, we had so much fun. All right, so we <laughs> are back and here is everything that we got for free comic book day, guys. Uh, yes. We were anticipating like eight comics. Um, we got so many. This is what we ended up with. Bridget actually got a few that she gave us too. So yeah, we ended up with a lot of comics. Like this is crazy. We did buy some, but I only spent $4, $4. That's it. Yeah, it was really crazy. Golden Apple Comics had an incredible deal that was like three comics for $1. Mm -hmm. So Megan got 12, $4. Yes. But then, yeah, we thought the limit was going to be eight, but they literally just kept handing us. They were just like, here's more comics. comics. Here's, we like, this is a free we, comic. We already got, we already got <laughs> some and they were like, it's okay here. Just <laughs> so yeah, we walked away with a ton so of stuff, like just absolutely insane. Uh, so we got this like Spider-Man and Venom. Yes. We got the Marvel Voices. This is one that they kept just trying to like hand everybody. Everyone. They were like, you want Marvel Voices? <laughs> they were like, sure. The Children's Vampire Hunting Brigade, which looks really cool. And look, and we got, got it signed. Uh, the writer was there and he uh, was so nice and he just signed the comic for us. So yeah. That was awesome. Megan got a bunch of the one dollar comics mm -hmm. uh polarity she also got olympia i basically was just looking for ones that had covers that i thought looked really cool and i wanted to try out Broke so Planets. there's just there's, there's so, so many. many if you guys want to see like a more detailed like breakdown of everything that we got let us know uh, we'll probably make we some tiktoks about them we can but i would say that this was a very successful yes. free comic book day yes. i'm so glad because we haven't really got to go to a comic book store in a while and especially out here in LA like we haven't found our comic book shop we yep. have a lot of manga shops that we really enjoy going to but we haven't found like a comic book place so mm -hmm. Golden Apple the the crew there was like so incredibly so nice, nice. And so they uh, were so sweet that, that might be our, our comic book yeah store. and it's not that far so yeah very nice but we've got a ton of comics to read we're gonna share more on TikTok and on Instagram and all of that stuff yeah. and yeah Good day. Let Good us know day. if you celebrated Comic Book Day in the comments. <laughs> uh, let us know. It was so fun.